QTV Multimedia. Watching QTV. I'm. Oh man, so checking in with QTV Multimedia. What's up? This is QTV. You heard? Yeah. Uh huh. All the way live in the ATL. Yo, 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 we in the building, we in the building, and we got a special guest for y'all. Let me let me, let me make sure I got this volume down on this uh, Facebook, and we finna go in all the way. Yes, so happy Friday, happy Friday. You in the building with QTV. Thank y'all for logging on. Uh, happy Friday and all that good stuff. My name is Dr. Harper. I am founder and maestro of Project Keep Them Off The Street, which is a 501c3 nonprofit youth organization. Uh, we also have an event coming up for the youth. Y'all know we got to have a nonprofit to give back to the community and make sure that our youth, our young folks are straight, get behind them and support them as uh, much as we can. Uh, this event is going to be January the 23rd. Peacots Inc. Just Us Team Talk from ages uh, 10 to 18. The address is 560 Thorn Road, Suite 209. But you have to pre-register to get in the building. That's at www.pkots.org. That's pkots.org. PCAS, acronym for Project Keep Them Off the Streets. The deadline for registration is February uh, 17th. So y'all be sure if you got them young ones, y'all know what's going on, man. Let's, let's, let's see what they're talking about and try to uh, aid and support them and get behind them in some of the ventures that they may have. Also, the creative mind behind QTV Multimedia, where the pictures are worth a thousand words, but the video tells it all. Uh, this is your one-stop shop for all your graphic marketing and advertisement needs. And guess what? We got a special guest in the building, man. She coming through. She coming through, man. Her name is Tootie. Is it Tootie? I say it's Tootie, right? It's Tootie. <laughs> there it is. There it is. And all the good sisters are going to tell us, man, about her new music, man, where she from, what she got going on, and where she planning to go with this music. You did what I'm saying? Um, sis, what's up, though? We in here. Talk to us. What's up, y'all? How y'all feeling? For sure, for sure. We, uh, this, this up, this up now. Let's, let's, uh, let's, let's get into it. So, uh, hang on, we ain't gonna hold, you, we ain't gonna hold you. So, wait, where you from? I'm from Abbeville, Georgia, but I currently live in Statesboro, Georgia. Statesboro, okay, that's what's up. And and, and what school did you attend? What, what, what's, what's your school background? Education background? Um, I attended Wilcox County High School. Okay, that's okay. Or well, just a real, real small town. For sure, for sure. And uh, and were you involved in any kind of um, um academic specials, arts. Talk I, I to play, us about your school. Play basketball. Huh? I played basketball. You did? Okay. What about what about the talent? You had some talent going on in, in the school too, right? Yes, I did. Um it started when I was in middle school. Me and my friends would, you know, like um we would kind of like try to do like a talent show, like at lunch and at breaking things for the like, the other students. Yeah. And started with, like people was actually enjoying it. We kind of like just kept it up and made like maybe like an everyday thing. Mm -hmm. and, and, how, and how how was that for you though? Did you did you get the crowd? Did the school like you? Was you able to do it often? To, to walk us through that. Um, we wasn't able to do it often because, like I said, we're from a small town. Things were like limited. They were very very strict about certain things. But um, I was kind of like I had like a love hate relationship with my with my school because a lot of people liked me, but a lot of people didn't like me. So like I was on the homecoming court. I think I won like second place, but you got to. 
uh, as far as the music side, like nobody really supported me. Really? Once up to, like high school, it became like a hate relationship. Yeah, yeah, hey, welcome, well, welcome to the real world. <laughs> so, so anything you done in school, did it, did, did anything grab hold and take off for you? Were you involved in any kind of talent shows, or did you host anything in your hometown growing up? Like, you know, no, no talent shows. Um, our school wasn't really into those kind of things. Like I said, okay. because it, I was so low funded, I think it was like eighty three people that graduated in my class. It was a real small like. So. Okay, for sure, for sure. So, so tell us, how old were you when when um your musical talents was discovered? What take us take us there? Um, so when I was about four, my grandmother was a minister, and she it started off like she made us sing in the choir, and you know we was young, we didn't want to do that, but she made us do it. So I kind of like grew a love for singing, and once I got in like the fifth grade, um, me and my my cousins we would like like do like American Idol, but my mom she didn't know I could sing until I graduated, so. Um, when I got in like middle school, I kind of like got into rap a little bit because that's when like the OMG girls were out, you know, those like those kind of like girl groups. So right. me and my friends thought we was the OMG girls and you can tell us otherwise. So, <laughs> <Please>. <laughs> but none of them, none of them like knew how to write, write rap. So I would have to like write everybody's part and then I would have to like come back to school and give them their part so they could learn them. That's when, that's when like the talent show, not the talent show, that's when we started like doing it for the, like the school on, um, at lunch and like and breaks and stuff. Yeah, yeah. So you started. So you was uh, the, the ghost writer and the producing all that good stuff. Then um, I was correct. Uh, for real. Okay. Right, right, right. So, so where did you first display your 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 talent? Was it church or was it school? Church. Church. Yeah. And what 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 were you doing in church? I was singing. I yeah. from pre K up until like fifth grade, sixth grade. I was singing, only singing. Right, right, right. Hit a, hit a note right quick. You still sing? You still, you still, you still? Uh, still I mean, say like some, something that you know you like that you can do. Just, just, we just want to hear that voice right quick. Any, anything, any, any, anything. A tune, uh, it's a, you know what I'm saying? Because somebody going to want you to sing on, sing on something. No, you know? I'm, not, I'm not into singing anymore. It's strictly okay. right. Yeah, okay, it's good. That's just right, how my right. Say that part again. You broke out. That's just how the career started, but it's strictly rapping now. Oh, for sure, for sure. You look like you're like a quadruple threat, so I know you got it all for him, right? Yeah, that's what's that's what's up. So this 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 hip hop coming into the rap scene. What 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 does the hip hop mean to you? Um, honestly, I would say you mean like what inspired me to get into it, or? That's hip hop in general as an acronym, because I got an acronym that, that I found out what hip hop mean. But you know, uh the, the founding fathers, who were your inspirations that uh that that got you into rapping? What does it what this yeah? I would definitely say Lil Wayne was one of the people, like one of the first people that I actually like listened to and was realizing that he was like he was like a lyricist. Mm -hmm. Like he 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 kind of taught what it was, what it meant to like put in punchlines when you're rapping and like those kind of things. And like I said, as far as like just the girly side, like mm -hmm. being more feminine, it was like the OMG girls. Cause like I said, that was more my era. Mm -hmm. But I would definitely say Lil Wayne is one is one of the reasons I kind of like stepped in the hip hop. For sure, for sure. And then are you like, uh, and, and it's up now. Is it a single? You got a whole project album? Tell us about it. Uh, up now is a single. Um, I'm releasing an EP soon. You guys need to stay tuned for that. But awesome. up Dropping uh, March the seventeenth. March the seventeenth on yes. all streaming platforms. Yes. Okay, so uh, you have any features and and uh, two part question: Do you have any features and who are some of the people that you're looking forward to working with? Um, I do not have any features on this project. It's just strictly me, just you know me. And the, the EP is going to be called "Remember Me," so I want it to only be about me, so you guys can kind of get a view on who I am as an artist. And um. Some of the people that I would like to work with, definitely Carla Ray. I would say she's like top priority for me. Okay, okay, okay. Shoot, we, let's take a second and uh, shout out some of your people, man, out there. Tell them to share this, share this live. Y'all share this, share this, man. We got Tootie in the building. Um, shout out some people you you know you you, you came up with and, uh, and who's showing you some little who behind you right now. Honestly, um, just shout out to my parents because they're very supportive, and shout out to Fred because he's been very patient with me, just like 
teaching me everything I need to know, showing me all the right ropes, and getting me in contact with the right people. So definitely. So Fred got that info. Fred got shout out to two hands. Salute to Fred, man. His situation. Uh, most definitely though, man. Fred gonna get you right, man, with that information. Man, I done called Fred several times and had some <laughs> Q and A for him. You know what I mean? So most yeah. definitely shout out to Big Homie, man. Um, hip hop as an acronym. Um, uh, there was. I, I wrote this down too. So hip hop as an acronym, it said higher infinite power healing our people. So when you're mute in your music, no matter if it's keeping it real, giving people the game, giving them the map to where to go, how to do it. What's what's your message in this in this, in, in this up now? What's what's your message? Basically saying, like, you don't have to be up next. You can literally be up now. Like, you don't have to wait in line. Just go for it. For sure. We're going to play that thing, too. Why don't you go ahead and introduce it, and we're going to try to hook this thing up. And uh, go ahead and introduce it. Okay, y'all. This is a premiere of my new single, Up Now. I hope you guys like it. What the fuck, man? I've been did it, host in your place. Stay in your place. I'm so thankful for God's mercy and grace. Mercy and grace. I'm so sick of these niggas. Give me space. Please give me space. I've been solid with bitches from the gate. From the gate. Yeah. My nigga love that. Yeah, he like that. Yeah, he love when I shut shit down. Your bitch hate that. She don't like that. Matter of fact, ho, fix your frown. Uh-uh. I might fall down. Get back up. Let me readjust my crown. Y'all hoes cap. Cap tough shit. Storm beef then let it die down. I touch y'all hoe what y'all hoe know. I did. You claiming you having but broke. You, you popping you but don't want no smoke. I swallow fine. Your bitch she a choke. Five figures, six figures. Two player to be for by the nigga. I, am. I was born I am. by the river. Sam Cook action figure. Uh-uh. How your folks uh-uh. rocking with you? We like Nettie and Sealy, fuck a mister. To these hoes, I'm looking bigger. Pussy pun, I he official. Melon Coop been rocking with they me. Have. I gotta they get have. my mom beat me. I, I said it I on do. his face gently. Fuck the hate, they all lingy. Who do. on next? Nobody, bitch, I'm on top. I'm shin shit down. Who up next? Everybody know Titty don't play that shit up now. Who on next? Nobody, bitch, I'm on top. I'm shin shit down. Who up next? Everybody know Titty don't play that shit up now. These bitches be acting like I'm not the teacher. That nigga a pussy, he is not the reaper. Not popping my pussy for a single feature. La ho fall in line like follow the leader. Been gone for a minute, I'm back in this bitch. These hoes swinging miss, so they hate when I pitch. You running your mouth, I can't fuck with no snitch. Like, knock, I just do it, it's never no glitch. When I'm feeling biggie, I throw on some coogee. I never reply, so they say that I'm bougie. No April fools, a nigga can't fool me. Look down on these bitches like they ain't Lil Uzi. The top of the charts is where I see my name. And riding no dick, I'm not fucking for fame. And cut for no nigga, they cannot be tame. These hoes ain't the fact that we are not the same. Six Six figures, seven figures. Keep a real hitter with you. Drip sticky like a sticker. Ballin' like K. Little with the clippers. I, I already know who rockin' with me. My mom deserve her Bentley. I said it on his face gently. Fuck the hate, they all lean. Who on next? Nobody, bitch, I'm on top. I'm shin shit down. Who up next? Everybody know Titty don't play that shit up now. Who on next? Nobody, bitch, I'm on top. I'm shin shit down. Who up next? Everybody know Titty don't play that shit up now. But yeah, talk to us, sis. Um, I just told you what the um hip hop mean to us on this side. Um, tell us where you what this 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 singer you got going on. Where you trying to go with it, and, and um, what what do you see projection? Where do you see your future going with this particular song? Um, I just hope it like I hope it builds the confidence and everybody that's like feeling like they have like I said they have to wait in line or they're not good enough. Um, I want this, like, it's 2023. When 2028 comes, I hope that we're still here. Um, I just hope that it's still sticking. Like, I hope that they're able to still, I hope that they're able to go back and still turn this song on and be like, oh, this song still hit. Like, I'm just trying to create music that sticks. No matter, like, how long it's been out, how old it is, I just want to create music that sticks. I appreciate y'all for being with us. It's Titty in the building. What new the fuck, song, man? new singer, new music alert. Sis, tell them what it is again. We're gonna, we gonna take it back. Okay, y'all, this is my new single up now. I hope you guys enjoy it. 
city. A number one, I been did it, ho, stay in your place. Stay in your place. I'm so thankful for God's mercy and grace. Mercy and grace. I'm so sick of these niggas, give me space. Please give me space. I been solid with bitches from the gate. From the gate. Yeah, my nigga love that. Yeah, he like that. Yeah, he love when I shut shit down. Your bitch hate that. She don't like that. Matter of fact, ho, fix your frown. I might fall down. Get back up, let me readjust my crown. Y'all hoes cap, cap tough shit. Storm beef, then let it die down. I taught y'all how what y'all hoes know. I did. You claiming you having but broke. You, you popping but don't want no smoke. I swallow fine, your bitch, she a choke. Five figures, six figures. Two player to be for by the nigga. I, am. I was born I by the river. Sam Cook, action figure. Uh-uh. How your uh-uh. folks rocking with you? We like Nettie and Sealy, fuck a mister. To these hoes, I'm looking bigger. Pussy I pun, am. he official. Melon Coop been rocking with they me. Have. I gotta get my mom beat me. I, I said it I on his face gently. Fuck the hate, they all in it. Who on next? Nobody, bitch, I'm on top. I'm shin shit down. Who up next? Everybody know Titty don't play that shit up now. Who on next? Nobody, bitch, I'm on top. I'm shin shit down. Who up next? Everybody know Titty don't play that shit up now. These bitches be acting like I'm not the teacher. That nigga a pussy, he is not the reaper. Not popping my pussy for a single feature. La hoe fall in line like follow the leader. Been gone for a minute, I'm back in this bitch. These hoes swinging miss, so they hate when I pitch. You running your mouth, I can't fuck with no snitch. Like, knock, I just do it, it's never no glitch. When I'm feeling biggie, I throw on some coogee. I never reply, so they say that I'm bougie. No April fools, a nigga can't fool me. Look down on these bitches like they ain't Lil Uzi. The top of the charts is where I see my name. And riding no dick, I'm not fucking for fame. And cut for no nigga, they cannot. I be tame, these hoes ain't the fact that we all not the same Six figures, seven figures, keep a real hitter with ya Drip sticky like a sticker, ballin' like K. Leno with the clippers I, I already know I who rockin' with I me, do. my mom deserve her Bentley I said it on his face gently, fuck the hate, they all in they Who on next? Nobody, bitch, I'm on top, I'm shin shit down Who up next? Everybody know Titty don't play that shit up now Who on next? Nobody, bitch, I'm on top, I'm shin shit down Who up next? Everybody know Titty don't play that shit up now. Who won't next? Who won't next? Who won't next? Everybody know Titty don't play that shit up now. Hey, that thing, that dope. <laughs> Thank you. For real, for real, for real. Let's let, let's turn this thing all the way off right quick. Yeah, yeah. That way. Hey, I'm digging that, sis. Thank you. What what inspired that? I hear you, I hear you talking to the fellas and and, and and telling the other ladies out there, hey man, who want who who want next? It's up now. Talk to the young ladies, man. Tell them what they need to be need to be knowing. Cause I hear the message. Tell let them let them know. Basically, don't take no shit from no nigga. Yeah. Get in your own bag. Be independent. My daddy always told me, whatever you want a man to do for you, make sure you can do it for yourself. Yeah, and and, 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 and for them, if, if since you sent a message to the men, then get a brother something too, though. Tell them what how they need to be coming. <laughs> Just on that shit, like period. Let them know what that is. Oh, be in, be in your bag also. Know how to treat a woman and just be a man. If you got kids, take care of your kids. Be all about your business. Yeah, let's put to the uh, information in the chat so everybody can tap in with her. Uh, plug yourself in, Tootie. Tootie. Make sure y'all go follow me on all social media platforms at OMG. It's Tootie. That's O-M-G-I-T-S-T-O-O-T-I-E underscore. And we're going to have all that in the chat, too, man. Now, before you get out of here, I told you we ain't going to hold you long. You got your new music. Tell them again uh, when it's dropping, where to find it at. Up now, it's dropping on all on all platforms on March the 17th. So make sure y'all go get that. Make sure y'all follow me on social media to stay tuned with what I got coming next. For sure, for sure. Anything you want to say to the people? Uh, just thank you for supporting me on my journey. All right, all right. Now, once again, shout out to your team, man. Shout your team out. Let them know who put who, uh, who, who got that muscle behind you and support y'all here in these streets. So support hard to come by. Once again, shout out to Fred, the most solid person I ever met. Uh, so you got any shows coming up? What's what's coming up for you? Um, yes, I will be performing um in don't laugh at me. How do you say it? Smyrna? Smyrna? Smyrna. Okay. <laughs> I'm country. It's in Atlanta, um, in the Atlanta area. I'll be performing up there February the nineteenth. It's a day party. It's from two PM to nine PM. So Okay, what they need to do to get in to come to come see you. Get your autograph and all that good stuff. Tell them they better get in now, but how, how, what they got to do? 
The ten dollar entry free. Entry fee. Titty in the building, y'all. Put your comments in the comment section. Appreciate y'all for stopping by QTV. Since you want to give them anything up before we get out of here. Uh, that was all. Thank you guys for tuning in. Like I said, make sure y'all go get that. It's up now. It's dropping on all platforms on March the 17th. And we're going to do a part two. So you got to come back, man, so we can get this thing together and get it right, though. You feel me? Your, com your, uh, your info is in the contact section. Hey, man, shout out to you and your whole team. Shout out to Fred, man. Um, yeah, keep doing what you're doing. Stay rocking, stay rocking. Keep that pen on that pad and keep your foot on the gas. You hear what I'm saying? <laughs> to the in the building, y'all. Y'all go follow her, follow her, man. Support that movement, man. And that's the campaign, what she got going on. Give them the date again or where you'll be performing at, sis. Uh, February 19th, and it'll be in Smyrna, Georgia. For sure, for sure, for sure. Okay, I'm quite sure you can tap in with on her page where she gonna be at. And uh, y'all go tap in, tap in. If I ain't doing that, I slide through. You throw Medusas and all that good stuff, man. Shout out to your whole team. It's Tootie in the building, y'all. QTV. And hey, we're going to sign out. We're going to get this thing right. Y'all stay tuned, man. She'll be back, man. They'll be back. We'll be back, man, because we black like that. You feel me? Hey, shout out to everybody, man. Happy uh, Friday. Enjoy y'all weekend. You did. See y'all next time. Peace and love. QTV. QTV Multimedia. TV signing out. You're still in the QTV. Watch the QTV. I'm. Oh man, so checking in with QTV Multimedia. What's up? This is QTV. You heard? Yeah. Uh huh. All the way live in the ATM.